All right, some good tips there. Chelsea, thanks so much. Generations of people here in Corpus Christi have learned to fish at the Oso Pier, but those days are gone. That's because the pier is no more. The owners, however, are vowing to bring it back. Here's Rick Spruill. If you've ever walked through the door of the Oso Grill and Pier, you've probably met Hondo. The good news, Hondo survived Hurricane Harvey. It's the pier that's gone, ripped apart in the storm. Owners Mario and Yulia Martinez aren't surprised. I kind of expect I even had a dream that morning that the pier were gone. That's because the pier is Corpus Christi's oldest. It dates back to the 1940s. The Martinez's took over the place just last January, but Harvey hasn't thrown them off course. The kitchen's still open, the beer still cold. Martinez says he learned to fish off of this pier and now he's ready to rebuild it. That's exactly what he's planning to do. We're going to rebuild it. Long story short, uh, uh, we'd be happy if we will. Martinez says they have to rebuild it because the pier is really the heart of the place. That and the back porch feeling you get when you walk inside, or maybe it's the mixed matched furniture. Or could it be the pirate Robert who's still keeping watch out on the pier, or rather what's left of the pier? And then there's good old Hondo. We'll be waiting to see you the next time you drop by. Rick Spruill, Chris 6 News. And by the way, Martina says he is hoping that the state of Texas will help him rebuild that pier. Let's hope that is the case. Yeah, because a lot of folks, we've been watching on Facebook, a lot of folks deeply saddened. Yeah. I mean, in, for a lot of reasons, but when that pier went away, that uh, certainly was one of them. Well, Hurricane Harvey's impact, I think,